I got into swimming when I was eight years old. My two best friends back on Bainbridge Island, Washington, uh, were in the summer swim team. Their mom was the coach, and she was like a second mom to me. I just wanted to be with them and with their family all the time. Um, so I joined the swim team, loved being with them, loved getting the Tuesday morning donuts after morning practice. It was kind of a mess. I wasn't very good at it at first. I would plop in the water instead of dive because I was too scared. I would forget to put on my goggles all the time. Uh, I didn't know how to blow bubbles. <laughs> but after learning and getting over all those hurdles, I really fell in love with um, the camaraderie that came with swimming, but also the racing component. And when I was deciding kind of what sport I wanted to do around 10, 11, um, I settled on swimming because I loved the water, I loved being in the water, and then I loved just racing. When I was really little, my si older sister always wanted to come to Stanford and do gymnastics here, and I just wanted to do anything she did. So essentially Stanford was on my radar initially only because my older sister Brooke wanted to come. Um, and then as I grew up and was actually thinking about college seriously, I mean Stanford right off the bat was um, in the Pac-12 and in Northern California, which is super close to my hometown, Seattle, Washington, uh, not too far of a flight. Um, and I'm really close with my parents and my family, so I wanted to be pretty close. I grew up going to the Pac-12 championships for swimming, which um, have been in Seattle, Washington, I think for the past 11 years. So going to that and watching everyone race in the Pac-12, I wanted to be a part of that when I was younger. Um, and then, I mean, as I kept looking at colleges, it's just like, this place, like everything it has to offer in terms of uh, professors and academics and the coaching was a huge piece for me and feeling like I was right at home with Greg and Tracy was a really crucial component of deciding to come here. These facilities that we're at right now I think is the best swimming facility in the world. So it just like there are so many components that went into me choosing Stanford but I could not be more grateful and thankful that I ended up here. I think Stanford has affected me in numerous ways and numerous aspects of my life for my future self. I mean, I came in not knowing what I wanted to do with a career, and I now am very passionate about going to law school in a few years post-graduation. Um, I learned that I never knew I was interested in law and took a American law course here and a social psychology course here and fell in love with both of those two things, and I'm hoping to integrate that moving forward after I graduate and do something with behavioral psychology integrated with law, and I didn't know that coming in, and Stanford taught me that. My favorite part about Stanford is definitely the people. Um, the people that you meet in your classes, in your dorms, the professors, the TAs. Um, I mean, my favorite people of all the people would be my team. And I've been fortunate enough to be on a team with I think 41 swimmers now by the time I graduate. And I can call each and every one of those teammates like one of my friends and one of my closest friends. And I genuinely can say like, I've learned something from everyone who's been part of my Stanford journey. Um, I think just to emphasize the people here have really shaped me and learning from each and every individual I've come into contact with to just be a better version of myself. And that's just something I can't put a price on. Everyone here is so special and I think you forget that sometimes when you're in the midst of it and you're in the hustle and bustle, but if you step back and you're reflecting on your Stanford experience and as I have kind of being a senior now, I've just realized that everyone here is so special and everyone has had an impact on my experience and my journey and um, it just I've learned something from each and every single individual and I am so grateful for that and I don't think I can put it into words how much I appreciate it. Yeah.